do sharp teeth and sharp claws a meat eater make. This is the picture of an iguana. Now, iguanas, of course, grow in Central America, the Caribbean, and so forth, and in South Florida. And they can grow to be, again, six and a half feet long. They're entirely vegetarians. And you can see the very big, sharp claws right here. I think you'll agree you don't want to get scratched by one. Here are the teeth of an iguana. Do you notice they are sharp? They are pointed. But you can see the serrations. Now, why do they need that? To, to eat the thick, fibrous vegetable materials that they eat. Take a look at this jaw of a T-Rex. Now, here you see T-Rex teeth. They are big, they are sharp. You would say, man, this thing must eat meat. They are pointy, they look menacing, I agree. But if you look in this photograph very carefully, you'll start to see, for instance, right here, that there's an edge, something that's on the edge of this tooth. You can see back here on some of them that's on the front and the back edge of each tooth. And what are they? Well, what you're looking at are serrations. These serrations are on the front and the back edge of a T-Rex tooth. The teeth are sharp, but they have these serrations, which would only be needed for actually eating tough, thick, fibrous vegetable materials. They're not required for eating meat.